Hey, what's going on? It's Rico with No Born Concrete. Woo! It's hot. It is very hot. We're working in an enclosed spot, no AC, and uh, I wouldn't have it any other way, man. I love Florida. But speaking of Florida, South Florida Avenue, right behind the Ale House, is the new upcoming church, uh, Word Up Ministries. They actually had uh, a location downtown that they were kind of hopping around from, but they've, you know, grown in, in a short amount of time. And thanks be to God, God's been blessing their ministry and just helping them expand and reaching, uh, reaching the loss. It's such an amazing thing. So No Boring Concrete has partnered up with them. This is their new location. And uh, we're working in a spot that's going to be their cafe. So they're going to be serving coffee, lounge, hangout, before, after church, all that stuff. So that's going to be pretty cool. So if you haven't checked it out, check them out. Great pastors, Frankie Floyd, Robbie Ratcliffe. Uh, great guys, uh, down to earth, solid ministry, solid word, and um, heart for God. So can't ask for more. And that's why I love partnering up with, with people like that. So today we're going to be... Um, putting down the base coat for a metallic epoxy job. That's the other exciting thing. I love those because they got so much movement. No one's really doing it. They're actually like the new upcoming polished floors, believe it or not. So everyone's uh, going into this industrial look. Well, this is gonna be off the chain. So it's gonna be pretty exciting to see. So we prepped the floors, they've been ground. We're taped everything off. And then we're gonna be putting down the base coat. The reason we put a base coat and we put it in a dark color is because metallic epoxy happens to be very transparent and translucent. So if you put that down, you can get some pretty cool effects, but you will see everything underneath it. So unless you go super, super thick, but if you have a dark base coat, you can get some really nice shadowing to the point where it almost looks like you have two or three colors in there, a lot of depth, a lot of movement, and all you did is uh, used one single color. So the color we're gonna go with is, it's kinda like a, a gray, uh, medium to, to dark gray color. It should be uh, pretty nice looking once it lays down. But we're gonna be putting down the base coat, finishing that off, and then the next day we come back and we put the metallic epoxy coat, and then we put the uh, protectant sealer um, so it keeps looking nice for years to come. Here we are, day two. Yesterday, we just put the um, base coat down. It's a water-based epoxy, black coat, so you have a nice undercoat for the shadowing effect. Today, we came back, we sanded down, so we got good adhesion um, for the epoxy to bond to, and today we're putting down the metallic epoxy coat, AKA the money coat. This is what everybody pays for. This is what everybody's seeing, loving, and wanting, so we're about to put that down. So. We've already uh, prepped it, we cleaned it, we got the mixers going, and we're gonna put the sucker down. We are finally done. I mean, I thought I did some pretty nice floors and the product itself just speaks for itself. But the way these guys at Word Up Ministries, the way they just put everything together with the custom tops, tables, the furniture, the, the little cafe serving area, it's just the TVs, everything, it looks awesome.
So wow, what a transformation, right? Like we went from uh, a, a plain, boring concrete slab and in and, and a, and a leased area, you know, you're just leasing it out and a lot of people don't want to put too much money into it. But, you know, honestly, at the end of the day, by the time you figure out what I charge or what someone would normally charge to install this versus what you're going to pay in materials, labor, by the time it's all said and done, it, it averages about the same. And if not, you're, you're, if you do pay a little bit more for this, don't, don't you always pay a little more for something custom anyways? So the great thing about this video is this is just a sneak peek of what I have coming with the uh, recap series that I've been talking about that I want to go back to previous jobs that I've completed because a lot of the times when I finish, I'll come through and I'll do a final walkthrough right before I pack up and leave and, I, and I've, I've just finished but everything's empty. Now you can see the place completely furnished, the, 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 the lighting, everything's painted, the trim is up, it just looks like a million bucks. And, and you can't ask for more than just happy and pleased customers who are going to want to refer you. And, and I just love working with people who, who want to do something different. This is metallic epoxy. So you have a slab of concrete, you put down the metallic epoxy, you have a hundred variations it's literally that you can, you can come up with. You can mix colors, you can do one color, two colors, whatever. Um, we have some glow in the dark colors. We have some stuff that'll make it look like water. You can embed logos into this. You can make it look like fire. You can put fiber optic lighting into it. Whatever your heart desires, you can do. On top of that, you can put this in your garage. Um, I get calls now where people rip out their carpet and say, hey, I want that metallic epoxy stuff and let's do it there. So we do it indoors and we do it all over the place. We've even been putting the stuff on concrete countertops and I have a video for that too and I have some pictures on that uh, on my website about that as well. So I'm glad I was able to show you this. I hope you love it. I think it's a really cool place. Again, we're at Word Up Ministries in Lakeland, South Lakeland, their new location. Check them out, get plugged in. Continue to follow us on Facebook, NoBoringConcrete.com on Instagram. Subscribe, follow. Thanks. That's all I can say. Peace.